Hello, NJH Plays here. Welcome to a brand new city, which I do not have currently, which I do not currently have a name for. Uh, this city will be a vanilla build for the most part. I will be using some mods, which I can show right now, and I will be using no workshop assets. So I'm using just a few quality of life mods, stuff like 81 tiles, stuff of that nature. So you know, nothing game changing, just some quality of life mods, and I guess 81 tiles would be considered a game changer. But it's just so we have the extra space and we can build all over this map. As far as inspiration, uh, we are going to be inspiring the city off of some areas, probably some regions in Arkansas, possibly Kansas um, or Oklahoma, just somewhere in those in those regions. And as far as where the city, uh, the city I am taking inspiration from, uh, I'm taking inspiration from the YouTube uh, creator, City Planner Plays, and I will be using his uh, his grid that he has um, for a few reasons. Um, uh, the grid that he used for Verde Beach, which was, I believe, it was something along the lines of, it was like 300 by uh, 220, I believe, that, that, that much. And so I'm going to be using that grid um, because most of the unique buildings will fit inside of it. And, you know, you can divide it up into smaller lots if you need to, and there's still plenty of space. So that is why I'm going to be using that. So let's get into this. So first things first, we're going to connect these up. So I have a plan for what I'm going to do. So we are going to set up a sort of industrial area over here along the coast and we can, uh, you know, fit a fishing industry later on in here. And we're going to have our residential area over here. I want this to be straight. Let's see if I can connect to these other nodes. Snap to this one. There we go. All right. I'm going to bring this down to about here. And I'm going to bring this here. And then we're going to connect this up. Let me use a two lane uh, one way road to. Okay, so now for water, we're going to use a generic water tower. We're just going to put a power plant over here. Make sure these are all connected up with water and sewage uh, water treatment. And now we just need to make sure this is all connected with power, and I think we'll be good to go. And we're going to run this, and we're going to zone some residential blocks in here. And as for what we're going to do here, I'm not sure. Um, I might take out this. I'm probably going to take this out and make this something else. I might just make this a normal interchange. I could put a highway through here, but I'm not, I don't think we're going to do that. Why is this not connected up? I guess we just got to bring this a little bit further. Oops, didn't want to do that.
And you know, we're going to leave some space for paths because I think we're going to put paths through here in the future. So I'm sorry to take away these people's homes, but I should have done this earlier. Alright, I'm also going to turn off the day and night cycle because that's going to make it difficult to play. So let me turn off... We will set it to, what, almost noon? I think we're going to upgrade this road just because this is kind of functioning as a highway at the, po at the moment. I think we're going to expand this a little bit. I'll come over here and fill some more of this in too. We can also lower our budget for uh, water right now. We don't need it to be so high. So let's turn that down way down. We'll turn that down to what's it? about around 70%, I think. You know, we don't even have this. We don't even need to worry about that because we don't have the day and night cycle on. All right, so we're going to speed this up a little bit. And this is looking good. I'm proud of this. But right now, we just got to wait for this to expand a little bit, I think. We're also going to work on expanding our grid on this side. So let's go ahead and start that. So I think we call this Main Street. Ooh, I don't know what's going on there, but that's not right. Also going to connect this up here so we have a little bit more uh, options for uh, a ride if you're trying to catch a ride. I think we're going to come back here and let's see how our power is doing. Do we need this line still? Uh, yeah, we need it. Oh, look at that. We just got our next milestone. Okay, so we're going to look at this real quick. We're going to take care of this. So we have landfill site elementary school. So let's slow down the simulation. And we're going to, I think we can upgrade this road. Yeah, we can. So let's do that real quick. And we're going to run into some issues, so I'm just going to pause the simulation real quick. We're going to upgrade it to here. And then we are going to come in here, make sure our zoning is fixed right. There we go. We're going to connect up to, to the power. We're going to get a health clinic in here. Hey, that's expensive. You know, we're going to keep running the simulation. There's no reason to keep it positive anymore. And for school, we'll place a school. Place that right in here. That does leave space for a path if we put it right here. So that's good. We have 5,000 bucks left. And we have some industrial demand. Can we put districts here? No, we can't. We also want to place a landfill soon. And I think we'll put that in here somewhere. But I want to be cautious of where we put this so we can move it in the future if we want. If we put it here, this will fit just nice. Yeah, that will fit perfectly if we put it in here. So I might do that right here. And we'll speed up the simulation just a little bit. We're going to zone some more industrial along here. All right, we are losing money very fast. Um, I'm going to look at our budget real quick. Going to lower this. Or sorry, we don't need to do that at nighttime because we're not running at nighttime. Lower this. Gonna lower this. 
We'll raise our taxes a little bit so we get that extra income. Perfect. Okay. So we do have a growing demand for industry. So I probably want to take care of that. So I'm going to go back in here and, you know, we, I think we can get rid of these power lines now. Zone along. Yeah, let's get rid of these. Come in here and zone some more residential. All right, not bad. So now we're going to zone this side with some commercial. Along here as well. And I'm not sure what we're going to do with this road. This will probably end up being something else. Um, maybe we'll even turn this into a highway in the future. Anything else we have? How's our power looking? We're still doing good on power. Water. Garbage. Yeah, so we're doing good for now. I guess we just wait. Do we need these power lines anymore? Yeah, we do need those still. And we're also going to make sure our junctions are set up correctly. So this will be stop stop lights, or sorry, stop sign rather than stop light. That's unnecessary right now with the amount of traffic that we have. So if we're over here, things are still looking good. I think we're going to zone some more uh, industrial behind here and over here. So, uh, we'll keep this area open in case we need another one of these. And we're going to keep this here because that could make a nice park in the future. We will build around it though. So I'm going to go up 600. All right, we just unlocked our new milestone. So we have quite a bit more things to use now. We have these, so we're gonna get those placed right off the bat. Uh, I'm not sure what else we unlocked. Did we unlock? Didn't unlock too much else, so I'm just gonna slow down the simulation. Or it's already slowed down, Never mind. So we're gonna go down to 40. Perfect. All right, so I think the most important thing we can do right now is just get in here and place this in our industrial area. Place that right here so they also have good uh, connection to the uh, residential area. And they need water. So let's get them water real quick. And let's place a police station over here as well. Our water is looking fine. We're going to need more water soon. And we're going to need new electricity. We're going to just need to raise our budget on that. Raise that to around 80. We did not, we did not unlock paths yet. Okay, so... I might want to get another power plant placed soon just because we're going to have the demand for it. I don't want to grow the city too much till we have enough money for that, because that could be a disaster if we're not careful. Lots of fire trucks. Alright. Let's go ahead and zone some more of this residential. How much would a tile cost if I wanted to buy this tile? I think I'm going to buy this tile next. How much does that cost? $5,000. 
Okay. So for now, I guess we just wait, speed it up, and we'll see what happens. Um, actually, we'll, we'll add another block to this, just so that way we can grow a little bit. And, you know, we can also get in some... I'm going to build a neighborhood over here, a district. And over here, we'll also make a district. All right, so as for policies, we'll go with smoke detector distribution. It's quite expensive, but... Hopefully it will help us with fires. Over here as well. Smoke detector distribution. Can almost afford another power plant, which I think we're going to need very soon. Yeah, so we're going to get that as soon as we can place it. We can place it now. So let's place another one of these. Place that right here. And we're going to lower our budget, because I don't think we need as much as we're producing. So we're going to lower that just a little bit. As far as water goes, we're going to raise our budget on the water because we are getting kind of low. And now that we have that extra power, we can kind of just go about zoning. Um, there's not really much holding us back, so let's go ahead and add some more to our neighborhoods. Never mind, we just unlocked a bunch of new stuff. So, we unlocked parks, uh, high school, uh, quays, all kinds of uh, stuff. So let's get into placing some of this. You know, I'm, I think I'm going to go ahead and wait to do this, actually, because if we ever upgrade these to uh, normal dirt roads, which I can, uh, sorry, not dirt, uh, just roads, I can tell you that we're going to change. Uh, these are going to get destroyed. Whenever you upgrade a road, it will destroy kind of what's around it, so we might end up destroying these um, paths. So I don't want to put the paths in there just yet. As far as high school goes, can we, you know, we're going to change the speed a little bit, so high school. Still can't afford that. 24,000. I guess we'll just go ahead and put a small playground for this park then. Where's our school? It's right here. So we're going to go ahead and put a small park for this. That doesn't cost very much. Oh, okay. I thought that was going to be really expensive. What about this small park? How much does this cost? 1000 So I think we'll put one of these in our industrial area. Um, you know, we'll hold, off. we'll hold off on that, and we will make this a sort of desirable place. So let's go ahead and start. All right, so let's go. We can place our high school now. Let's place one in here. We'll put that. Put that next to the. Put that over here since we don't have. No, sorry, not. Uh, we'll place that across. Over here, we're also going to place a basketball court for that. All right, we have a very high demand for residential, so I think we're going to go ahead and satisfy that. But I would like to buy this tile, too. I think I'm going to try to wait. I'm going to wait for that tile, I think.
So that's where we could put a city park. Uh, actually, I want to look at natural resources too. So let's look at our natural resources. So we have some oil over here. I think we're going to work towards that. So yeah, I think we're going to buy this tile and then we'll buy this tile over here. We could turn that into a nice oil industry. So let's also let's look at the other resources. So we have farming over here. I don't know if I want to work towards that. We could also work towards this over here. All right. So I guess now we just wait. We could probably zone some more residential or sorry, uh, industrial over here. So let's come in here. Go up 300. Make sure they have water. They do have water. So let's go ahead and zone this. You know, actually, we'll just zone back here with industrial. We'll zone this with commercial. And I think we also unlocked some different policies. So I'm going to look at those. And I think what we're going to do is we're going to make some lower income neighborhoods closer to this industrial area. So let me look at that. This will be a lower income neighborhood. And we're going to make sure they have plenty of water. Which I think we're going to need to water. Yeah, we're going to need a water tower pretty soon. So we're going to need to keep an eye on that. All right, let's take a look at this area. We're going to make this a district. Policies. Schools out. We'll do smoke detector distribution over here as well. Let's get some paths in here just to make this just a little bit nicer. Uh, we'll turn off snapping. I'm going to be careful not to put these too close to the road so that way whenever we upgrade these roads, they don't get destroyed. We could get a nice maybe plaza in here for these uh, workers. So I think we're going to continue this neighborhood, this lower income neighborhood. You know, we're also going to get some fences in here as well. So let's come in here and we'll look at this forestry fence. You know, we probably want to give them an elementary school over here. Yeah, we'll keep an elementary school over here. That's probably something we want for this area. We're also going to give them a uh, playground. We'll give them a large playground if we, can, if we can fit it in here. Oh, look at that, just perfectly. So that's the benefit of using this grid size is it fits all kinds of stuff. We'll go ahead and I guess we'll build a fence around this. And I think now we're going to buy our next tile. So we're going to buy this one. Right, we are having some traffic issues here now, and these could get a lot worse because of this terrible ramp that we have here.
I think we'll upgrade this to a collector, actually. I don't know why I didn't consider that already. That might be a bad idea long term just because um, it's bad to have an intersection so close to the highway. But I think we're going to get rid of this highway eventually and move it somewhere else. I don't believe we have the road maintenance depot unlocked yet. Yeah, we don't. We're gonna slow it down just a little bit. I think we'll have some commercial in here to separate this area, even though we don't have a large demand for it. Let's see what, do we have any specializations yet? Uh, we do have the... Oh yeah, what, what about commercial? F yeah, we'll do organic and local produce over here. All right, so we're going to look at a library. I'm not sure if we can fit it in here good. Um, oh, that will fit perfectly in here. That's nice. Okay, so I think we could put it... We'll put it, uh, we'll put it back a little bit more. Oops, no, 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 I didn't want to do that. Put it in the wrong spot. I'm not sure how much it will cost to relocate this. Quite a bit. Alright, and we're going to go ahead and create a new district for this area. So we're going to place some commercial here. And we're going to connect them up with electricity. We're going to put a park here as well, too. I'm not sure if we can really afford that yet. Let's look at... Can we put this here? No, not quite. Will that fit side? No. So, uh, we will look at... You know, we're going to put some dog parks in here. Let's put some dog parks around. Let's put one over here. We don't have good coverage over here. All right, what other buildings do we have? Probably want to put another fire station over in our area, so I think we'll put this. We're gonna connect up this road real quick, and then we'll put it here. Uh, we'll put it in this area, I think. All right, we're also gonna build a nice park in front of this library. Oh, look at that, we just knocked our new milestone. We can now have highways. Look at that. All right. So I think we're going to call it an episode here soon. We've done a lot in this episode. And I don't want to get too ahead of myself. So I think we're going to call it here soon. All right, well, thank you for joining me. I think this is going to be it for this episode. Um, done a lot in this episode, so we have this industrial area over here in this little neighborhood. Uh, like I said, we'll probably go ahead and just put these paths in here and fences off camera just because that's a lot of work, and I don't think it's very interesting to watch. So, uh, let me take a look at real quick what else we unlocked that we could put in here before I call it an episode. We do have the post office, so I think we're going to put that. We're going to put that in here. And what else? 
We do have a cemetery, so we're going to put that real quick, too. And we're going to put that... I think we're going to put that along our main road over here. Hmm. Maybe closer to... Yeah, I think we'll put it over here. Yeah, that's a good spot, I think. Uh, and power. Alright, we're going to also place a new power plant because we're about to die if we don't. Or actually, let me look at the budget. Yeah, we'll raise that a lot. And same with water because I think we're going to need new water soon. We're going to raise all these because we're not where we used to be. Alright, we're also going to yeah, so in the next episode, we will uh, work on expanding the city a little more, I think. We will also uh, work on an industry, and then pretty soon we'll also work on a city park. So thank you for joining me. It's been, uh, it's been fun. Uh, and I will see you guys in the next one. NJH is out.